Blenheim Palace today and we're here for Cars and Coffee organized by Salon Privé and uh, we came up in a nice strong convoy, uh, two GT2 RSs, common. Common as muck. Yeah, and a 4 litre, a GT4 and McLaren and 964 Turbo. And um, so we've got, you can see we've got probably around 100 cars here today. We've got a selection of Lamborghinis, Ferraris, mostly new cars. And what's, yep. your, what's your favourite? Uh, F12 TDF. The silver one with the blue stripe. Yeah, the best thing I've ever seen. It looks pretty snazzy. Contemplating stealing it if I can see the keys in it. And what do you think about the uh, McLaren convoy here today? <laughs> he has the only McLaren here. <laughs> All the other ones are broke. When yeah, your 720 <laughs> breaks down, you won't be laughing, but okay. As it's funny for now. <laughs> <laughs> so we, we're the only McLaren here today. Um, but there is another 964 Turbo parked up next to mine. The Porsche allocation thing's boring. I'm bored of it. I'm bored of Porsche. Get in the bin. So when's your Porsche going? ASAP. Okay. GT3 is going to get in the sea. And what are you excited to get next? 720 McLaren S. 720? So Until you drove it, it yesterday, good good. Yeah. How was that? Really, really good. Really, really good. Uh, it's so you've driven my 650S on the way back from Scotland. I was amazed at how quick that is, but the 720S, it just, it feels, it doesn't feel like a supercar. It feels like the next run up from that, it's bonkers fast. It feels even faster than the 650? It bonkers fast, yeah. You yeah. wouldn't think that's possible no, after no, being no. in a 650, right? No, it's, uh, it's just another league. It's absolutely ridiculous. But it's genuinely obscene. I was bursting up laughing driving it because I didn't know how to actually react to what it was doing. Wow. Is it even smoother than the 650? Yeah, in comfort mode, it just it kind of just wafts about. Uh, but I've got the, the Lux spec coming, so it's going to have the big hi-fi glass all around, the comfy seats. Um, so you can spec it like a GT, which it works really well as a GT, or you can spec it with the buckets, Alcantara everywhere. And if you leave it in track mode the whole time, you've got a really dialed in like, kind of racing car. Okay, so let's walk around, have a look at the cars. Yeah, I think and people are probably um, sick of us. If you're still watching, let's go and see some cars. We bought a 250TR by a G2 engineer. We build a lot of the uh, parts for original Ferraris from the 50s and 60s. We do a lot of restoration work. You know, we've seen probably 30% of the real short wheel bases in the world through our workshop. So we know the original cars really well. One year we were a bit quiet in the workshop and decided to build a whole car. So what engine have you got in this? So it's exactly the same as the original engine, 12-cylinder Ferrari engine, classic design, noise, when we start up in a bit you'll hear it's pretty loud, it's a lot of fun to drive. But it rides beautifully as well, you can take it a long way, people go on long tours and it is one of the great cars to drive. And apart from this car, what's your favourite car at the show? Uh, there's a lot of good cars here. Um, I saw a nice McLaren 650S earlier, silver, particularly fast car I believe. So can we get inside the car and sure. start it up? Yeah, 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 let's go. Do you want, do you want to get it? You jump in the driver's cycle, go on. Chris? Okay. Okay. Obviously, this is easy. <laughs> You're not filming this bit. Let's jump back on. There you go. Old cars don't start. just left Blenheim Palace. It was an amazing event organized by Salon Privé Cars and Coffee. Um, we're now doing a photo shoot with the three cars that we brought. The 964 Turbo 3.6 from Bad Boys. The McLaren 650S, which was the only McLaren here today, so it got quite a lot of attention. And the 997 GT3 RS 4-litre, which came out of storage just for this event. So an amazing event. I'm interested to know your thoughts on what you thought was the best car there. Uh, for me, I liked the TDF Ferrari, but not in silver, but that car is amazing. And um, I hope you enjoyed watching, and stay tuned for more videos coming up soon.